Welcome back everyone to a new card making video. Today I'm creating a Tim Holtz inspired card with the new fancy floral dies and distress oxidings. I start by creating a background with the distress oxides. I dry the background between each layer to avoid that I create mud. I'm working with watercolor paper. I will create more background with this same technique, so I will speed up the process. Now it's time to start with the card. I'm creating a background with the stress oxides and the ink blending tool. I'm using a stencil from Stamplerations and spray water through it to create some texture on the background.
I cut a rectangle with the new stack tackle die from Tim Holtz and distress the edges with walnut stain. I picked up pattern paper from Die Cuts with a View and cut a strip with the same die I used for the background. I picked some burlap to create a banner and I also cut some alphabet circles from Sizzix and a birthday sentiment from Stamplerations and now I'm putting everything together onto a card base. The alphabet letters for the happy are cut from the background we created at the beginning. I need to cut off the bottom of my card because the European measurements are a little bit bigger than the US ones. Now it's time to adhere all the embellishments to the card. For these flowers I also used the backgrounds I made at the beginning of this video. My card is finished. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. Bye!